Larsa Pippen discloses her engagement to Marcus Jordan. Larsa Pippen discloses her engagement to Marcus Jordan. Larsa Pippen of Real Housewives of Miami was compelled to acknowledge her affair with Michael Jordan's son, Marcus, after being photographed wearing a ring on her left hand. Larsa Pippen clarified the situation on the couple's podcast, Separation Anxiety with Larsa Pippen and Marcus Jordan, saying, We're not engaged. Larsa Pippen clarified, But you did give me a promise ring. The Peacock star, who boasts 5.1 million Instagram followers, went on to add, The only thing we've come up with is that we want a destination wedding. Larsa teased that the relationship was moving forward earlier this week when she posted a cozy couple photo captioned, It's in the works. The 48-year-old was spotted with a diamond band on her ring finger as she exited a Hollywood restaurant with Marcus. 32, just last week, sparking engagement rumors in the press. Marcus discussed the podcast episode, saying, Paparazzi got us leaving the restaurant and asked if there were wedding plans in the works, and so, I think I responded in a cheeky way. He informed reporters that a wedding was in the works and that they were looking for a location for a possible walk down the aisle. Marcus stated that he had a hundred calls and text messages from people congratulating us after learning of the planned proposal. Larsa married Scotty Pippen, a former NBA player, in 1997. The couple had been married for 19 years and had four children when they decided to divorce. Larsa has been linked to various men in the years since her divorce, including a brief relationship with one of them. Larsa made headlines last month, after Marcus' dad seemingly expressed disapproval of his son's relationship with the reality star. Larsa revealed that she felt embarrassed after learning of Michael Jordan's comments. Marcus explained during the July 11th episode of the duo's podcast that his father had personally resolved all potential issues with both him and Larsa before his comments were made public. We knew ahead of time because he called me and texted me and wanted to make sure that I didn't take anything the wrong way, Marcus shared at the time. But then when the article came out, he texted me again and he never said hell no and that's not what the implications were. While Marcus initially laughed off the comment, Larsa admitted that she didn't find the situation humorous. You thought it was funny, Larsa told Marcus. I didn't think it was funny. There is nothing funny about it. She added, I kind of felt like it went everywhere and I was kind of embarrassed.